Hello and welcome to today's demonstration of the advanced rendering extension for Pro Engineer Wildfire 5. Today we will show you how to render your Pro Engineer models and make them look realistic and attractive for your partners and clients. In Pro Engineer Wildfire 5, we have a real time rendering option that can be activated by a single click. This user-friendly option shows shades, light reflections, and a big number of effects that can be configured to meet your needs and make your products look great. This doesn't stop us from using Pro Engineer and all its functions with usual high performance. You can just carry on working and modifying your model while the real-time rendering is activated. You can see how realistic the model looks and how the shades and light reflections are shown. You can also apply a full window rendering which allows you to place your model in an environment you choose and to define textures and structures for the surfaces of your rendered model. This gives you and your clients a very realistic idea of the final product. The next images show some examples of possible options and effects. In this case, you can see the exact mirroring on a chrome surface. Looking closer, you can also see that Pro Engineer calculates and shows all the light reflections and refractions. This image shows you the transparency of a part. You can look through the part and even see the light reflections on the cube in the background. As you can see, Pro Engineer shows the refraction in the class cube. You can also set a perspective view of your model and set the angle you want to show your product from. Effects and textures on surfaces are very easy to set with Pro Engineer Wildfire 5. You only need to choose the material you're working with from a gallery and Pro Engineer will use the realistic surface texture for the part. You can see the rough texture of the cast aluminium surface. Let's take a look at the rendering option in Pro Engineer and how you can render your models and obtain such images. With these cubes as example, we are going to display some photorealistic scenes with the integrated rendering settings and options. First, let's take a look at the appearance gallery. In this gallery, you can choose one of the many colors and assign it to one or many cubes. As you can see, the gallery is divided into three categories. In the My Appearance category, you can configure and create new colors to use in your active session. The category model shows you all the colors used in the assembly. In the library, you'll find a big number of predefined materials and colors. Under metals, we find the material chrome with different textures and colors. In order to assign one color to one or many of the cubes, we only need to choose the color and select one or more cubes holding control. Just apply the color modification and the cubes you selected have new properties and a new color. In this example, Chrome. We'll switch now to a predefined view and modify the perspective to suit our needs and place our model in a way to make it look great. With the perspective settings, you can define a number of parameters such as the eye distance and the lens. In order to perform an excellent rendering, we'll switch now from the basic renderer to our Photolux renderer that is integrated in the advanced rendering extension, which allows us to use all the advanced settings of the rendering option.
Now we can define a scene and place our model in a defined environment. To place the model in the environment we chose, we can either use the wheel or align the floor against the shaded model with a simple click. You can also add sources of light and modify the reflections on the surfaces of your model and make it look even better and more realistic. ProEngineer also allows us to set a depth of field and focus on a certain part of the final product. In this way, we can highlight a spot and get it to the front. Now all we need to do is select the output of the render. You can pick one of the many formats supported by ProEngineer. We'll choose JPEG to obtain a render in a picture format. With a simple click on Render Window, ProEngineer renders the whole model and delivers a great realistic shot of your product. The rendering options and functions in ProEngineer allow you to make your 3D models look more realistic and attractive to your partners and clients. With the advanced rendering, you can show the final product you're designing and reduce the amount of prototypes. We thank you for your attention and hope you enjoyed today's presentation of the advanced rendering extension for Pro Engineer Wildfire 5. For more information about the rendering options and capabilities, please visit our website www.ptc.com.